Well, tonight, all new Dateline focus on a case that we've been following for months now. Sarah Hartsfield is the Chambers County woman accused of murder after her fifth husband died in January. She also killed a man who never made it to the altar in 2018. KPRC 2's Bryce Newberry joining us now in studio with the new interviews you'll see only on two. Sarah Hartsfield had a top secret security clearance as an intelligence officer in the U.S. Army, and her career took her to Fort Eustis in Newport News, Virginia, for a few years. We tracked down one of her retired military bosses who's been following this saga from states away. 48-year-old Sarah Hartsfield is accused of murdering the fifth man she married, 46-year-old Joseph Hartsfield, in January. Her mugshot made it to the hands of a man who supervised her in the U.S. Army more than a decade ago. It was a little bit of a surprise. On second, it was like, oh my gosh, she finally got busted. The surprise was that she got caught. Captain Alphonse Markovics, now retired, calls Hartsfield whip smart. Her mind could separate and compartmentalize and do everything in sequence and, and do it the right way. Which is why he says he's not surprised she never got charged for fatally shooting David Bragg, her fiance, after her third husband. The 2018 killing ruled a self-defense justifiable homicide by Minnesota prosecutors. It seemed planned. In court, Hartsfield told Texas prosecutors she went into the house with two guns. He wrestled one away way and fired first during an assault, so she shot and killed him, calling it an automatic response and her only chance at survival. Seeing and knowing my brother and knowing the, the situation around it and the, the conversations that he had had, you know, with my parents about leaving and, and getting out of the relationship, it just felt dirty. It felt wrong. She never admitted any, you know, wrongdoing. She's just, she's not that kind of person. She's not going to. Now the case is getting a renewed look. Minnesota authorities could file charges, present it to a grand jury, or close it again. But the investigation isn't quite over. My brother deserved to have people he knew and cared about him and people he cared about speak truth. Minnesota's investigation has been reopened for almost three months now, and tonight there's no exact timeline for when it could wrap up. Meanwhile, Sarah Hartsfield is in the Chambers County Jail on a four and a half million dollar bond with another court appearance on Monday. Our special in-depth look at this case is coming soon on the KPRC 2 Plus live stream. Bryce Newberry, KPRC 2 News.